Hi, I'm Dr. Maria Machado, and I'm a chiropractor at LC Chiropractic. I'm Dr. Julian Machado, and I'm a chiropractor at LC Chiropractic. I wanted to be a chiropractor because of actually I was following my dad, but before, when I was really little, I used to work at his office since I was, I don't know, four years old. And after that, um, I went to college and I actually wanted to become an OBGYN or a pediatrician. And while I was in medical school um, interviews and doing things with my teachers, what I realized is that I was answering all my answers holistically and one of my professors actually brought it up to me asking if I truly wanted to go into medicine or if I ever considered being a chiropractor. And when he said that, I laughed and I realized it must be de destiny. Um, so I went to chiropractic school, became a chiropractor, and I actually specialized in prenatal and pediatrics so that I was still able to live with my passion of helping pregnant women and babies, but I can also still do um, chiropractic at the same time. Well, when I was 13, I was bouncing on a trampoline with my friend, and he bounced me up so high. That's the game, right? You want to bounce each other up as high as possible. So he was bouncing me up as high as he could. I lost control because I was so high up and I fell down on the corner of the trampoline on the frame, fracturing my spine in seven different places. So ever since then, I had to seek a chiropractor or different type of care since then. Uh, I went to see an orthopedic doctor after that. He explained to me that because of my injuries, I would be crippled and walking with a cane by the age of 29. After seeking a chiropractor's care, I've been able to play football in high school, do as many things as I want to physically without any limitations. So the biggest reason kids should get adjusted is one, have any of you ever watched America's Funny Home videos? So there are so many videos out there of you actually watching children falling and um, like just living every single day life. And they're hilarious, but at the same time, when you think about it, what is it doing to their spine? So a lot of times the very first, what we call subluxation or misalignment in the spine actually occurs with birth. So for our son specifically, um, I was, during labor, I was actually at nine and a half centimeters for over eight hours. And with each contraction, his head's hitting the pelvis. And the problem with that is that one of his bones got misaligned and it was actually causing constipation. So in the very beginning when our son was, when he was first born, he was actually, the only way he would go to the bathroom is when we adjusted him. We'd even tried testing it out. I went seven, I think I went up to 11 days one time and I was like, okay, enough's enough. And the, he would get adjusted and after 20 minutes, he would be able to go to the bathroom, which was super awesome. Um, a lot of other reasons why children should get adjusted is colic. So a lot of times we'll have moms who come in and they look so tired just because their baby is not sleeping. So when a child's super small, they can't tell you, hey, this hurts or something's not right. So what they do is they just consistently cry. Um, colic can come in many different forms. A lot of people know colic as gas. And again, it all has to do with the fact of how their body is able to digest. Um, so that's one of the biggest reasons, asthmas, allergy, a lot of times that bone shifting. So the first bone in your spine is known as atlas and that's one of the biggest ones that can shift very easily when you're a baby and actually first, um, when you're first born. And so one of the biggest things that affects the immune system is atlas and its position. So a lot of times when you have a, a decreased immune system, you'll see an increase in allergies and asthma. So you'll see a lot with that. Um, bedwetting as well, and um, just so many other healthy benefits, just making sure that your child's brain is developing and that your spine is healing and growing properly. So what's the difference between our office and other chiropractic offices? Well, a regular chiropractic office would be like a dentist's office, right? Whereas our office is more like an orthodontist office. So if your problem was a crooked spine or crooked teeth, you would go see an orthodontist versus seeing a dentist, right? Same thing with us. We specialize in your posture. So we're going to realign your, your spine through remolding your ligaments with our system of chiropractic care. So it is extremely healthy for the baby. If anything, it actually benefits the baby the most because if you're, the, puts the baby in proper position. So I don't know if you're ever familiar with when you hear, my baby was breached. That means that their baby's head was not head down first. So they're actually head up. And what we do as chiropractors, we adjust women, allow their pelvis to be in the perfect position that gives the baby enough room to turn and go into that proper position. When they're in that proper position, it allows the baby to be delivered as perfectly as possible so that there's no pressure on this baby's spine. Um, 
to allow them to not have these misalignments or subluxations. So that's extremely important for the baby's health and development. As well as for mom, it makes it so much easier and they're not as stressed and overwhelmed when giving birth. So that's why it's so important for moms to get adjusted while, while they're pregnant. All right, so why don't you get adjusted the first day at our office? In acute cases, we do, but we don't really like to do that because we have a system of care that we want to follow. And the system is care is to benefit you, not to benefit us. So if someone comes into our office, let's say for example, and they have a certain amount of pain. Now this pain has been you know, started for a long period of time or short period of time. Either way, we wanna find out all the factors that may have caused this pain. Now something that you may not think is important, we may find is important, but this takes time to go over it thoroughly. After that, we're gonna perform a physical exam. After your physical exam, if need be, we're gonna take a set of x-rays. Now the x-rays will take some time for, to analyze, and we're gonna go over them you know, with the head of doctors at our office, and then go over them with you on the following day. Once we go over your case with you on the following day and we know all the factors, then we can properly draw out a treatment plan that's gonna benefit you to correct your problem, not just maintain it. And that's the difference between our office and other chiropractic offices, that we go through a thorough inspection and we don't wanna just adjust you on the first day. I do specialize in prenatal and pediatrics, especially kids under 12. I did go through an entire certification series known as ICPA, which stands for International Child Pediatrics Association. Um, what that allowed me is to get the certifications that I need to properly adjust and assess and examine your children, as well as help with moms during the entire prenatal process. So that is how I became certified. So at LC Chiropractic, our mission is that we believe that every sick person has the right to be healthy and that every healthy person has the right to live the life that they want to live, the life they deserve to live. What happens is people start to adapt to the pain and they begin living the lesser life that they never wanted to live, but they're adapting to it. We don't believe that here at LC Chiropractic. We want you to have the freedom to live the life that you were supposed to live. And we're gonna help you do that.